The reusability factor is one of the most important and significant achievements achieved by any spacefaring nation's program. Reusability significantly reduces the cost, time, and overall launch of a spacecraft, and if achieved properly, can give a mighty edge to a space program and the nation itself. A Chinese commercial startup recently made headlines after successfully landing a rocket and achieving reusability. In the long run, China has achieved a major milestone with this achievement. Last year, a Chinese space mission made headlines and shook the whole world after news circulated that a Chinese spaceplane has just entered low Earth orbit for an unknown period of time and unknown mission. The secrecy on this spaceplane mission is something China has maintained, but fresh reports have emerged on this mission and everyone seems to wonder the same thing. What is China planning to achieve? In today's episode, we are going to uncover fresh new details on the return of Chinese spaceplane mission that kicked off last year and what the Chinese space program hopes to achieve. This is Race to Space, and if you like watching content like this, consider subscribing. The reusable test space vehicle was launched from the Jiuquan Launch Center in the Gobi Desert atop a Long March 2F rocket on August 4 last year. The size of the rocket fairing, as well as amateur sightings and tracking by the U.S. Space Force, all point to a vehicle similar to the American X-37B, built by Boeing but smaller. This is not the only space plane China launched last year. There are a record of two space planes launched by the Chinese Space Agency, and the secrecy revolves around mission. One space plane landed last year, following a record-breaking mission. Upon conclusion of the mission, the Chinese Aerospace and Technology Corporation, the official Chinese space agency reported, the complete success of this flight test has strongly promoted the leap forward development of our country's space transportation technology from one-time use to repeated use. Now, the Chinese space authorities said a reusable uncrewed space vehicle returned to Earth on Monday morning after 276 days in orbit, more than 100 times longer than its maiden flight less than three years ago. Little is known about the craft, which spent two days in orbit on its first mission in September 2020, and China's space authorities have not released any pictures or technical data. Some experts suspect the Chinese craft could be equipped with advanced imaging and sensing equipment to gather intelligence on potential targets or monitor sensitive areas of interest. Another potential use is the deployment of small satellites or other payloads into orbit. This could include communication satellites, navigation systems, or other types of sensors that could be used for military or government purposes. Based on the payload capacity of the Long March 2F rocket, which launched the reusable spacecraft, experts say it is likely to be similar in size and design to the U.S. Air Force's Boeing X-37B as reported by South China Morning Post. Space planes offer several significant advantages over traditional rockets for accessing space and conducting missions in orbit. Here are some of the key benefits. Reusability. Space planes can be reused multiple times, like airplanes, whereas traditional rockets are discarded after a single use. This makes space travel more cost-effective, as the cost of building a new spacecraft is a significant part of the overall cost of a mission. Improved safety. Space planes have the ability to glide back to Earth if something goes wrong during the launch or in orbit, providing a more controlled and safe landing compared to the parachutes used by traditional spacecraft. Additionally, the use of air-breathing engines for takeoff and landing reduces the reliance on volatile rocket fuels, which can improve safety and reduce environmental risks. Flexibility. Space planes can be designed for a range of missions, from launching satellites and conducting scientific experiments to servicing and repairing existing spacecraft in orbit. The ability to land on a runway also means that space planes can be used for emergency evacuations of astronauts or other personnel in space. Reduced launch infrastructure. Space planes require less infrastructure for launch compared to traditional rockets, as they can take off from a conventional runway rather than a specialized launch pad. This can make it easier to access space from a wider range of locations and reduce the impact on the surrounding environment. Faster turnaround time. Since space planes can be reused, they can be turned around much more quickly than traditional rockets, which need to be rebuilt from scratch for each launch. This can reduce the time between missions and improve the overall efficiency of space exploration and commercial activities in space. Increased public interest. Space planes are an exciting and innovative technology that capture the public imagination and generate interest in space exploration and science. This increased public engagement 
engagement can lead to greater support for space programs and funding for research and development. Overall, space planes offer a promising technology for the future of space exploration with the potential to reduce costs, improve safety, increase flexibility, and generate public interest in space activities. While space planes are still in the experimental phase, ongoing research and development are expected to lead to further advancements and expanded use in the coming years. There are many challenges in reusable spacecraft development, including the need for advanced heat shielding to protect it during re-entry, as well as robust and reliable landing systems and reliable and efficient propulsion systems. Extended periods in orbit can add further complications, such as maintaining the spacecraft's power supply, which requires advanced solar panels or other generation systems that can operate reliably in space. The spacecraft's thermal environment must be able to withstand extreme temperature fluctuations as it moves between sunlight and shadow. Long-term exposure to radiation can also damage the sensitive onboard electronic components. Keeping the spacecraft in lower Earth orbit for an extended period also requires precise control over its trajectory and orientation. These can be affected by atmospheric drag, gravitational forces from other celestial bodies and other factors, including solar winds. Engineers must carefully design the spacecraft's propulsion system to ensure that it can make the small adjustments to its trajectory needed to maintain a stable orbit or to approach a target, depending on its mission. The development of a space plane has the potential to offer several benefits for China's space program. One significant benefit is increased cost effectiveness. The reusable nature of a space plane can help to reduce the cost of accessing space and conducting missions, which is a significant part of the overall cost of a space program. With the ability to reuse a space plane, China's space program could potentially reduce costs and increase the frequency of missions, which would be a significant benefit. Another benefit is enhanced national security. China's space program has strong links to its national security interests. A space plane could help to enhance these interests by providing China with a rapid response space capability, which could be used for a variety of purposes, including surveillance and reconnaissance, intelligence gathering, and potentially even military operations. A space plane could also enable China to conduct a wider range of scientific experiments in space due to the flexibility and versatility of the platform. With the ability to rapidly launch and retrieve experiments, China's space program could potentially conduct more experiments and gather more data, leading to a better understanding of space and its impact on human health and the environment. Advancements in space exploration are another potential benefit of a space plane. A space plane could potentially enable China to conduct longer duration missions in space due to its ability to stay in orbit for extended periods of time. This could open up new opportunities for space exploration, including human missions to the Moon, Mars, and beyond. Finally, the development and deployment of a successful space plane would be a significant achievement for China's space program and would likely enhance its international reputation and prestige. This could lead to increased collaboration and partnerships with other space programs, as well as greater public support for China's space activities. The deployment of a successful space plane has the potential to offer significant benefits for China's space program, including increased cost effectiveness, enhanced national security, increased scientific research opportunities, advancements in space exploration, and increased international prestige. The success of China's space plane program will be an important factor in shaping the future of its space activities. With much about fresh new details on the return of Chinese space plane mission that kicked off last year and what the Chinese space program hopes to achieve covered, it is time to wrap this one up. If you have any topics in mind, comment below and we will cover them for you. As always, subscribe to never miss out. This is Race to Space and we will see you in the next one.